so it must be my lucky day. we get some Thank XP you. for that and, here you go. and what jobs does he have which way is our base again okay so our base is east so if we try and our base is how far away trader base count one point uh, roughly a yeah okay so we got a clear zombies tier 2 1.7 kilometers east which will be near our base so if we do this one first here quickly which is a tier 2 fetch not even 500 meters away uh, the old house pyramid I've not heard of that one okay so we'll do that and then we'll pick up the other quest Let's go. can actually do now is we can put this down we'll do let me pick it up it's not gonna let me pick it up but let me pick this up why can't I pick that up uh, yeah, all right pick this up pick this up I won't let me place it there which is really annoying so we'll just have to leave that there. Okay. Maybe we wait. Let me upgrade these two blocks here. We'll upgrade these ones over. So that way, I don't have to worry about doing any of the other stuff. Um, we've got our last needed ones here wooden frames so you can get this a building and then we can go and upgrade all of the ones there but I'd say the top section of this is starting to look more like a base so just gonna we'll drop down here just upgrade these corner sections because they are slightly painful to hit But I don't think we'll be able to. Ooh, wait, we could. Awesome. Awesome, okay. Yeah. There we go. And this is a nice boost to XP once we finish upgrading all of this. actually ran out of wood this is impressive so we'll have to get some more wood before it goes dark I say before it goes dark we've got four in-game hours before that uh, we actually need to put these away quickly and then here there and I suppose we can just scrap that. Scraps into ten paper. That's about to be done. And there we go. Okay, right. Um, we'll go over and 
do, you know, we'll drive, we'll drive to the other side, over here behind the trailer. There's a bunch of trees next to each other. We should be able to get these done pretty quickly, I think. We'll see how that goes. Spotted me, so I'll yeah, die. Thank you. Okay. Right. Take a drink and let our stamina recuperate. Now we can continue on chopping down trees because, you know, that's what you meant to do. You know, deforestation is a very serious job in the post-apocalyptic world. You know. wandering horde here. It's a mini horde, but you know. You guys gonna let me finish this tree? Are you? Let me mine my stuff in peace. You guys can carry on living. Or carry on being the living dead, I suppose. But, uh, they always just have to bug me when I'm trying to chop down trees and all of that sort of thing. Up to 59. Hopefully, hopefully, we can hope that this will be enough to finish upgrading. It's coming along though, it's looking very nice. Right, let's go make these all into planks. And then let's head down. Uh, in here. Yeah. We got these uh, branches. We'll need to keep everything else on us. But I've just noticed we take uh, we've just quick stacked a bunch of this stuff. Don't want that. Okay. So we've got these three blocks here, and then all the walls to do. And it's also approaching night time. Now I believe the traders restock on day 10. So that will be fun to go and see. See if they've got anything interesting to buy. You know, yeah, you know traders are sometimes. They can have the best items in the game one, one day. And the next they can have the worst. Something needs repairing here. What is it? That. Why does that need repairing? Hmm. Wonder. Very curious. again. Ooh. Oh 
Ay, ay, ay. Uf. Come on, we nearly there. There we go. Patching up the last hole. Oh, wow. We're a little bit short. There we go. Awesome. Okay, this is this is looking much more spacious. So what I'm gonna do, let's grab these items out. We're just gonna move these over one. Hi. Oh, a shotgun. That is brilliant. Okay, so let's see. What? Ah! This is the worst thing ever. How is everything he has buried supplies? <laughs> oh my gosh. Everything is buried supplies. So we're not taking a quest from him. Because I refuse to be buried supplies. But let's see. He actually has the Valkyrie drill schematic. Which is uh, kind of impressive, I suppose. Look at that. We've got a better AK here. Huh. See, that's two... Two things up. I don't know. We might take it. Hmm. See, it's it's really debatable. What does he have in here? Deployable dune buggy. Huh. He also has another AK. So two AKs. Interesting. Interesting. Okay. See, I wish, I wish we would have been able to get this because dune buggies are amazing. You know, like what's their cargo? The six hundred goes up to I believe they have six so it goes up by another three hundred to so nine hundred cargo limit which isn't really that bad. We'll go here looting one. Uh, you see now I'm gonna buy this purely because it's way better than a C class one. So yeah let's buy that. What we got here, uh, learning how to jump and land quietly in urban core. Learn it so. When sneaking, you always land silently unless you are taking damage and jump height is not reduced. Yeah, we'll take that. And what's this one? Drinking beer no longer blurs your vision and your buzz lasts twice as long. We'll, we'll get both of those, you know? So, just go back to this. What else does he have? Hmm. What else does he have? we look at this in a much he's got concrete mix we could buy a bunch of concrete mix we're gonna need it see I feel like this would actually yeah it is so much dismemberment chance well I've never I've never seen dismemberment chance or is that to do with attacking huh but yeah all right, so this this would like this one here would offer me a lot more wood and everything and do it way quicker. But it's S level, which is why. I'd still prefer like a much higher one. Um what else does he have? Badge Whoa. Sorry. These are actually very good. Um if you get uh, even a low class one, it's very good. So, doesn't actually look like he's got that much. Could upgrade our knife. No, we couldn't. I would say we just buy cement. Twenty-six is good. Yep. Y'all come back now. Okay, and then uh, the outside. Not much has changed. We flattened that area out. We've added this wall to stop the zombies from hitting over here which means they're more likely to just come this way and then over here of course we still need to take all of this out we've got the flattened area down now why uh, i know why it's because of my leg because it's, it's sprained isn't it so let's get my stamina back there we go On the inside, obviously, we've got more room here, and we've moved the cement mixer here, and we have the better research station. Now, 
centerpiece of the top floor survivalist sam always there ready and defending the base nothing except the flattened section out there has changed on the top and of course not much has changed on this bottom floor either although eventually something will happen other than that I think it's been a good uh, kind of productive you know we've gotten ourselves an AK now we have a pistol we've got we've upgraded our pickaxe which is going to be really handy especially considering we're going to be doing underground base sections so I think it's been all in all very good of course, ve uh, compared to normal video, uh, normal live streams on a Sunday, shorter. But I don't know what is oh, oh, what has happened. Like, I feel absolutely shattered. But next live stream, we'll come back. I will have a list of things that we will be getting on with. So, as always, remember to like, comment, and subscribe. If you guys have any thoughts or suggestions about the base, leave it down in the comments below. And. Uh, always stay safe and I'll see you in the next one